My guests today are women on a mission. Please meet Missy. She says she's here to get her ex back because even though it was a short relationship, her pain has lasted an eternity. Uh, Missy, what's going on? I'm here to get my ex-boyfriend, Kevin, back. Uh, your ex-boyfriend. How long have you been with him? Um, we were together six days. <laughs> did, you, uh, did you find out his full name? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Not his middle, because I really don't pay attention to the middle names, but yes. Yeah. But Kevin's uh, you know, that's hardly a, uh, you know, a lot of memories. Jerry, six days, six months, six years, eternity. You cannot tell who you're going to fall in love with. You cannot tell when you're going to fall in love with them. It's, it just happens. And when it does, you know. Okay, and this was perfect. Yes. And you guys, like, how did you meet? We met online, actually. On this day. <laughs> but we, we were talking for two, two and a half months before we ever met. We got our friend basis down. And then we met, and it just clicked. And it clicked. And you moved in right away together? He moved in with me. Right. Yes. He stayed with me. And the whole time we were together, he was saying how much he hated this girl he's with now, the, the ex at the time, because they dated two weeks before we got together. Okay, so he had a girlfriend. Broke then up. he broke up, meets you online. Yep. And when I go up to this town and hang out with him, he comes back with me to my house. We, he lived with me for a week, and he was saying how much he couldn't stand this woman, how much he was waiting for somebody to just beat her ass. He asked me to beat her ass, to teach her a lesson. Maybe that's why he drove back with you. He, he was trying to hire somebody. He was telling me he didn't want to leave. He didn't yeah. want to go back to Cedar Rapids. Well, then why did he? Because I told him I needed to move back. I was on maternity leave, and my job was waiting for me. I was down at this oh, other so town you have taking a child care now. of my mom. Yes. And, and, and he, oh. he... He loves my child. He was telling me, looked me in my eyes the night that all this stuff went down, looked me in my eyes and told me that he wanted to be the father of my son. He loved me. He loved my child. He wasn't letting nobody, nobody come through it. Then how come he left? I don't know. <laughs> okay. This girl is like the size of China. I swear. Oh. Uh, we, we better move into the next studio. <laughs> yeah. 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 So six days, and now what happened? I still love him. Well, where, where'd he go? He, he went with her. He left well, me for so, her, and I want him back, and I'm not But he probably was answer. just playing you. No. Well, if he went back to she her... She called his phone. She stalked him the whole time we were together. Yeah, but he could say, he could change his number, he could get a new phone, he could simply say, you're out of the picture. You don't m move in with someone just okay, because Okay, then why did he tell you. me he loved me first? He was telling because my best friend. Because he's a guy. He lies. <laughs> <laughs> but he was Usually telling... you can tell that. When you look at a guy, if their lips are moving, that's lying. <laughs> So you're lying to me, Jerry? <laughs> I would never do that, because basically I'm a woman. Uh, I used to be Sally Jesse Raphael. <laughs> uh, when was the last time you talked to him? Well, the last time we actually spoke spoke was back in May, but I did call whoa, him. Whoa, whoa, wait a second. May? May, but I did call him on his birthday to tell him happy birthday. Okay. Let's just take a break and go to reality just for a second. Okay. You haven't seen him in five months except for calling him on his birthday. Yes. He's moved back with his girlfriend. You were only with him for six days. Is it possible that he doesn't have the same feelings you do? No. She bribed him. She pretty much blackmailed him to leave me to get back okay, with her. Okay. But if he is in love with you, wouldn't he be trying to call every day? Wouldn't he be working out some way to the come and see The cow probably ate his phone. <laughs> That's how you get, well, that's how you get as big as China. <laughs> you got to eat a lot of phones to be as big as China. Now, Whitney is this other woman. Yes. Oh, here's Whitney. Yes. <laughs> he doesn't want you. He gave me this promise ring, not you. Leave him the hell alone. He doesn't want you. What don't you understand? You haven't talked to him since May. Why? He doesn't want to talk to you. He would have returned your calls or your text messages, but no, he doesn't want you. Yeah, you called him on his birthday, but who answered his phone? I did.
did because he didn't want to speak with you. <laughs> China's got a point. I mean, I mean Whitney's got a point. Yeah, Whitney's got a point. But I'm saying. Look. I don't care what he gave you. I don't care what you guys have. It's not me that was stalking him the whole time he was with me. That was stalking your dumbass. That was your dumbass. You're the dumbass. You're the one that's that sat there and wouldn't even <laughs> Okay. All right, what's this? Natural colors, dirt. Okay, Whitney. <laughs> Highlights? Yeah. I Wh didn't change myself to be with him. Okay, Whitney. You need to change yourself. <laughs> so, I bet the audience would agree. So he's, so he's, Whitney's living with you. Yes. And he, he says he loves you. And he says he doesn't want anything to do with right, her. Right, it was a six day thing, it was a rebound. That's all it was, Jerry. <laughs> and he's, but you admit that he hasn't been in touch with you. Yes. Because, well, no. You phone. mean there's been no moment that he could get to a phone and call you? I uh, okay, honestly Jerry, don't know. He came back to Cedar Rapids not because of her. He came back because of me. Right. He didn't even want to leave. He hung out with no. me that day, and then bam, you right know after why? that. You know why? I'm a firm what? believer on staying What? <laughs> Here's Kevin. Right here. Right here. Nope. I ain't gonna hit you. That's the bitch I'm gonna hit. Bring it. Well, see it, cause she knows no, how to whoop no, your ass. You're gonna stand here. Stop you're gonna stand me. here and explain to me why you f lied. Ooh, why you lied about my son? I didn't lie anything. Oh, I love you. I want to be with you. I love your son. I want to be the father of your son. In the back of her car? I didn't lie to you about Snaps. Okay, but here's the point. Do you want to be with her? No. Too bad. Exactly, because you're a whore. Too bad. <laughs> I ain't Too taking bad. no I fun ain't answer. Nothing. Shut up. Bring it. Oh. Yeah. Throwing punches. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. Shut up, I'm not done with I don't you. hit that. Oh yeah, you don't even hit that hard to begin with. What happened to I can't okay. stand Whitney. I can't stand the sight of her. Somebody should beat her ass. Oh Missy, you should teach her a lesson. What the hey, you Mike, should be taught a lesson too. I ain't getting one. Did you say did you say that to her? What, Jerry? Don't lie about okay. it. Okay, did you say that you wanted her to beat her up? I may have said it at that point in time because I had, I had a broken heart and I thought, well, I wasn't probably going to get back. But with you really her, so love her. So I was her. trying to find somebody else. But at that point in time, like a guy is just thinking of one, it's not the one on their shoulders. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so do you love her? Yes, I do. Well, talk to her. Go. Babe, I'm sorry about everything. And it's and fine. And not, we this, made it this through this, useless. but she keeps it going. She's she keeps worthless. texting and calling us and stuff like that. Like on my birthday, she called Who answered and the phone? texted. Right, and you did because I let you because I don't, like, if I don't know that number, I'm not going to answer it. I'm just going to let it go. And Missy's phone number is not even in your phone. Right. The only important people that call me, That's like, her number like in, my, in, your in phone? my phone, they're, you wouldn't even let him names. answer his phone okay. when he was down his there. His phone died while he was down there. Oh, you no, were it died. You his uh, emails no. and started emailing That's me. That's why I was sitting on his lap. Oh, you don't love her, you love me, and all this bull, other bullcrap. Look, you know what? 
Yeah. When okay, you mentioned my son is when I got on the internet. Okay. So, but what he you seems to be saying, what he seems yeah. to be saying is he doesn't, that he's moved on. Whatever those six days were, this is the woman he loves. If that's the case, why are you trying to keep it going? Because he doesn't want to be with you. Seriously, that's you can't help who you fall in love with. And when somebody says, I love you, they're supposed to mean it. You can't love somebody no, after six days. <laughs> We'll be back. If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing, take care of yourself and each other.